Good morning, it's Friday morning. And I'm so glad that you've joined us again for Kings at Home Daily. Uh, as I say, we're going through the book of Habakkuk, which uh, uh, is difficult enough finding, let alone understanding. But I'm, I'm doing this little devotional at, uh, in Habakkuk because I believe it's really, really pertinent for the days that, that we're living in, the turbulent days that we're living in. I think it will really help us uh, as we do it. So uh, that's why we're in Habakkuk. And if you've managed to find it by now, one of the minor prophets and uh, uh, we're in chapter one and i'm going to pray and then we'll see what the lord has for us today ah oh, there's some lovely things for us this morning lord oh please come and do us good this morning lord oh please lord there's lots of things that can trouble us and uh, throw us this morning but our eyes are on you and i pray now you'll speak to us as we prepare for a new day so come holy spirit speak to us help us i pray do us good in jesus name Okay, so um, very, very brief recap. Habakkuk, trouble, term, t tumultuous days. There's turmoil and chaos all around and lawlessness and bad things all around the people of God. And uh, Jerusalem's about to come crashing down and the Babylonians are going to... It's confusing and, 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 and Habakkuk's saying, Oh God, oh, how long? I'm crying out to you. Where are you? Are you here? And God's saying, Oh... Yesterday we saw, look, watch, and be amazed. I'm going to do something. You're not. I'm work. I'm going to do something unexpected. You, you, you might not. You know. You, I, I'm. I work. But I'm working through it all, bringing around my purposes, and my purposes are to build my church, the beginning of my new creation. Okay. So that's where we go. Okay. And now we're in chapter one, and we're in, we're in verse twelve. So. Uh, we began with Habakkuk, how long, how long? God spoke, look and be amazed. And he speaks about God work, about working unexpectedly through the Babylonians, these, these, through the circumstances around them, these evil people around them. God's going to bring about his purposes. Habakkuk is thrown by all this, like you and I might be. What do you do when you feel thrown and you, you can't make head and tail of what's going on, maybe nationally, internationally, or personally. What do you do when you feel thrown? When you just don't understand? I'll tell you what you do. You do what Habakkuk did in verse 12. You remind yourself of beautiful truths that will hold you. Look at this, verse 12. Lord, are you not from everlasting? Oh God, you are eternal. In this world that is changes by the moment, governments come and go, things, things happen so fast, you are eternal. Is that, that's, that's good news. He's reminding himself here in, in the transience, turbulence of the world around him, God, you are eternal. He who was and is and is to come. That's your God. That's mine. Remind yourself of wonderful truths, okay? When you're feeling thrown and you're wondering, what's, what's tomorrow going to be like? God, you are eternal and I'm yours. Got it? That's the first thing we see there. You Are you not from everlasting? Yes. Next thing, my God. Now, in your version, it might say, I think it might say Jehovah. Yeah, you might find it's there, Je the word Jehovah. Or is it the next line? Anyway, this, my God, I love this. You're my, Lord, you're, my, you're eternal and you're mine. In fact, you and I can say, you're my Father. How good is that? In a turbulent world when you don't understand what God's doing, He's eternal. He's your father. He's your God. Oh, oh my God. M my holy one. In a world that's full of unrighteousness and such pain and sadness. And God, you're holy. You're, you're, the, the, you're awesome. <laughs> oh, you are. You're, you're, you're righteousness. You're, you are the righteous judge. You're holy, holy, holy. You know, it's a bit like Isaiah, you know, 
few years earlier than um, Habakkuk, you know, holy, holy, I, he, he, mine eyes have seen the king, you know, I think the king had just died with Isaiah. In the year that King Isaiah died, I saw the king. And he was just overwhelmed at the vision, holy, 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 all the angels are crying, this is God, he's your God, he's mine, he is not uncaring, unaware, away. We need to remind ourselves of these wonderful truths. You get the idea? God, you're, you're eternal. You're my father. You're my... Uh, it gets, gets even better. Okay. Uh, so my my God, my holy one, you'll never die. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, this is great. And then you, Lord. I think this is where the Jehovah bit in your Bible might have. Jehovah. The, oh, Lord, Jehovah. The... The, the, the Lord, the, the, the God of the hosts of heaven, Jehovah, um, the, the deliverer. Uh, it, oh, this is our God. He's your God. He's my God. He's my deliverer. He will bring me through. He will bring you through. <laughs> this is why we, it's important we, that you, uh, you have these truths to hand in, in, in turbulent days to remind yourself who you belong to, who's in control, who's going to have the last word, whose hands your future is in. You're getting the idea. This is, um, it goes even better. You know, uh, oh, you appointed them to execute judgment, Lord. You, you are you are going to have that last word. You will bring judgment. You, 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 you will bring righteousness. Unrighteousness and evil will not go unchecked. You're the righteous judge. And one day you will bring your righteous judgment to bear. Okay, so he's reminding himself, oh God, you're eternal from everlasting. You're my God. You're the holy one. You'll never die. You, Lord Jehovah, appoint them to execute judgment. And here we go. You, my rock. Do you know, I, I think for some reason I've really been enjoying that phrase recently um, in the Psalms, my rock. My rock, you know, when everything else is shaking, when the world's turbulent, my rock, my rock. We're building our lives on, on a rock. My life is it's not on sifting sand. You know, I, I, my confidence is not in bank balances and, and uh, uh, career or whatever. My confidence is in the Lord, the, my rock. My life is in Christ. The, the, I'm on a rock. I'm... There's a, oh, on Christ the solid rock I stand, all other ground is sinking sand. <laughs> God, in my rock, oh, is, it, is it your rock? It's Psalm, it's, it's, it's a favourite expression of the psalmist, God, my rock. Isn't that beautiful? Um, and uh, so I, uh, my time's nearly gone. So I, 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 this, this is such an important point in turbulent times when you don't understand what's going on, when you're tempted to be perplexed, confused, anxious, worried, when you're tempted to be like that. What do you do? You remind yourself of magnificent truths. Lord, you're eternal. You're my Father. Okay? My God! My holy one, you're going to bring justice on the earth. My rock. <laughs> Use those expressions today when you feel like what we feel a bit wobbly. These are truths that will hold you fast. This is how we walk the walk of faith. By holding firmly to magnificent truth in turbulent times. And Lord, we want to do that today. What? What, oh, I'm just blessed thinking of those things. That, you're my rock. I'm moving. I, I, if I stand on you, I, Lord, I, you, you don't move. I, I'm secure in you. Building our house not up on the sand but on a rock. On, on you, Lord. And uh, you, we can say, my father. And you're, 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 you're the altogether beautiful one. You're holy. You're eternal. Lord, we love you. We thank you for these magnificent truths. May they hold us fast in wobbly days, in, in changeable days, so that we won't be thrown. Go with us today, wherever we're going, I pray. May we know your presence with us. In Jesus' name. 
I mean, well, I hope that's been a little bit helpful, and I hope that you will come back again on Monday. We'll go a bit further in our study in Habakkuk. God bless and have a good day.